In this video, we're going to look at points inside, outside, or on a circle. I'm going to start with a simple circle where the center is zero, zero to explain this. So if we take this point as the point five, zero. So my radius is five. So this is also five. And you guys know from your trig knowledge what two values would satisfy the right angle triangle where the hypotenuse is five. We could have a three and a four or a four and a three. So let's look at this point where the center is zero, zero. And the radius is five. So the equation of this circle is x squared plus y squared is equal to r squared. So x squared plus y squared is equal to 25. So let's look at the point three, four, which will be this point here. So we're going to have three squared plus four squared equals 25. 9 plus 16 equals 25. 25 is equal to 25. So therefore, we can say it's on the circle. So when it's exactly equal, the left-hand side to the right, it's on the circle. Now let's pick a point inside here. Let's pick the point 1, 1, somewhere here. Let's check 1, 1 and see what happens when we put it into our equation of a circle. 1 squared plus 1 squared equals 25. Of course, it doesn't equal 25. 2 is less than 25. So when it's less than, we can say point is inside the circle. It's a really simple lesson. This just three things to remember. You do have to remember them. Is it on the circle? When is it on? When it's equal? When is it inside? When it's less? Now pick an obvious point that's outside the circle. We could pick the point six would be here, six one. Let's pick the point six one. Let's see what happens now. So we're gonna have six squared plus one squared equals 25, 36 and one, 37 is greater than 25. And when the value for the points is greater than the radius squared, we can say that it's outside the circle. So three really quick, simple explanations for inside, outside, on. You should be able to remember these. So I'll give you a couple of questions to practice and then you can move on to LC circle five. Let's have a look at this first point. Is it inside, outside, or on the circle? So x is 2, so we have 2 minus 2 to be squared, plus y is 1, 1 minus 3 to be squared equals 9. So we're going to have 0, and we're going to have 4 is less than 9, so it's inside. Try the next one x squared plus y squared is equal to 30. The point B is 3, 3. So just put your values in. 3 squared plus 3 squared is equal to 30. 18 is less than 30. So again, this one is inside. So let's try x minus 2 to be squared plus y plus one to be squared is equal to four. And your point is six, five. So we're gonna have six minus two, four squared, plus four plus one, five squared. Is it equal to four? 16 plus 25 equals four. 41 is obviously greater than five. So this one is outside the circle. Final one, x squared plus y squared is equal to 26. And the point C is 5, 1. 5 squared plus 1 squared equals 26. 26 equals 26, so it's on the circle. So really easy topic within leading search circle and geometry of the circle. Make sure you know the three key things on the circle. It's equal inside, it's less than, outside, it's greater than. 